Hi guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. I'm Evelyn. So today I have a pony effect haul for you guys. Recently, her brand have a end of the year sale, and I went to her pony effect counter. I think. Yesterday, I, yeah, I went to her counter yesterday. Um, she was actually scheduled to be there at um, Mitsukoshi A11, like A11, down in Shingyi, like downtown, for I think like a meet and greet. But she was really sick that day, so she can't be there. Uh, she, I think she went to a lot of Prince conference in Taiwan and she was scheduled to have like a 40 minutes meet and greet there but she was so sick to the point that she can't go so that was a little bummer but I think like I kind of understand because I just want her like I think health is most health is most important so as long as she's healthy I'm okay with that but I also got a lot of stuff from her brand and I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I got there and before the yesterday purchase, I also have a huge purchase from Aimimi. Aimimi is basically like a bigger, it's like, it's also like a makeup brand, but Aimimi have Pony Effect in her brand also. So Pony Effect is a, like, I think like her, like her own brand. And then Aimimi also have some of her products in there. and. They had a huge sale um, around like a couple weeks ago and I also bought a lot of stuff from there because that's such a good steal. I have to get it. So I'm going to go ahead and talk you guys through all the product that I bought and if you guys want to watch it, please keep on watching it. So let's start with the haul. Do you want to see how much I got from her brand? Like, like this much? The box is this, this big and I kind of spilled the whole thing in But I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I got from her brand Let's start with primer So I got two primer from her brand One is the Prime Protect Sun Base And the other one is the Strobing Luminizer and uh, the Sun Protect Sun Base is just a regular, not regular, it's just a primer with sunscreen, I think. And it's really, really light in, a, in like a really good way. You know, sometimes when you put on sunscreen, it has this like heavy oily feel and it has that SPF smell to it. But her sunscreen don't have the problem. It so if you open, it looks like this and it comes with a pump and if you pump it out, it's actually more like a moisturizer consistency and it's really really light and it's really easy to just spread it over your hand. That it smells really nice and it has SPF 50 plus and PA, PA quadruple plus. So it's really really high SPF and it can protect you from the sun and the second one which is the luminizer um, it's really cool that before you open the bottle you have to pop a hole into this little thing here because this bottle is vacuum packed so to keep the fresh freshness of the luminizer they make it into like a vacuum thing and you have to pop that open to use it and it's just I think this is more it's just like a strobing cream um, but with really really thin how do you say sparkles like it looks like this and when you spread it out into your skin it leaves a really beautiful I don't know, can you guys see it? It leaves a really beautiful glow on your skin. Kind of like, can you guys see it? Like a little bit glow on my skin. Because sorry, like the light is kind of strong. Let me turn off. Like, a little bit of glow, kind of, kind of, 
maybe yes yeah um it's really pretty and i like it i never have like a strobing cream before so this is my first and now i'm about to foundation and i am like totally guilty for this but i bought four foundations i know like i'm really sorry but i have four foundation here um Number one, I got one cushion and three liquid foundation. I got the Pony Effect Cover Stay Cushion Foundation. This this one claims to be like a foundation more for drier skin, I think, but uh, more for oily skin, I think. But I don't know the. The person that worked there say it's really good, so I bought it. And yeah, I actually wearing I'm actually wearing the cushion on my face today. And let me tell you, the coverage is crazy, and I love it. <laughs> you only you literally only need like one tap into the foundation, and you can go half faith without dipping back in. That is like how full coverage it is. Oh, by the way, I'm in the color Rosy Ivory, and this is the color that I have on my face today. So then like, let me show you how this foundation look like. This is my hand. I actually have the cushion here, but I'm do it again. Like, it's really, really full coverage, and it literally blends in my skin looking like nothing. It's actually a really, really nice match shape match also so i really like this foundation and it comes with a refill also so it's pretty nice and i think it has the sale when the sale is on this cushion is retail for 990 dollars it's like a thousand dollars nt which is like 30 something dollars us which is like a pretty good price for pony her um, product is not the cheapest, but the quality is there. So that is the foundation, and I also have two more liquid foundation. One is the Cover Stay foundation in like the liquid version, of the Cover Cover Stay foundation. Let me open it. I really like her packaging. Also, it's like really sleek and like pretty. So this is the found the cover stay foundation. I'm in the I got the color in natural ivory, which I think is a little bit too bright for me. But um, winter is coming, so I think I'm still gonna be a little bit paler, or I'll just use a whitening cream with it, and I think that'll work. This is the foundation. It looks like this. It's really salt, like it's not really liquidy. It's really creamy great coverage and I haven't tried it on my face before but the shade looks a little bit yellow a little bit too bright but I'm trying to make it work <laughs> the other up foundation is the seamless foundation I also have the color in natural ivory and it's SPF 30 PA, PA double plus and for the cover stay is also SPF, SPF 30 PA double plus and this is how this is the seamless foundation looks like. The seamless foundation is really liquidy, so then I think it's better for you to shake it before you use it. So it's like this. I think this came out during the summer because the formula is really, really liquidy and it looks like it will be pretty matte. Let me show you the foundation. It's like, it's like it. Like it will drop if you it's really liquidy. And actually it's not that liquidy. It's more is liquidy or is more liquidy than the cover stay, but it also feels really creamy, it feels really nice. And I also think that I have the wrong shade because it's a little bit too bright. But and last but not least, I have 
Butter Balm Foundation Palette. This is, I think it was out, this is out like a long time ago. Like I think a lot of the product here are out a long time ago. But when this first came out, I actually have the urge to buy it because it's so cool. Like the concept is, like it looks like a, like a butter box. And the concept is that, I think you slide open. Nope. Oh yeah. You, when you open it, it has a palette for you to uh, mix your butter with. And if you open the seal, I'm not gonna like fully open it because I'm still not gonna use it. So I try to keep it fresh. It has five different compartments in here. So this is the foundation and this concealer. A contour this is a soothing balm I think you can put that in as like a moisturizing factor in there and the one bottom here is a highlighter so the concept of this is you can like scoop in some the foundation with some highlighter to make your foundation really glowy or foundation with concealer to make your foundation having more coverage or foundation with the soothing balm to I think like make it more moisturizing and it's really customizable and it also have the texture like a butter that's why it's called a butter foundation I'll definitely try this out on camera because it's such a cool um, concept and just the packaging is really cool so stay tuned for that I will be doing a video on this butter foundation soon and that will be all of the foundation phew and let's move on concealer I bought one of her concealer this is the Pro Fit Liquid Concealer with SPF 30 PA Double Plus and the color in Ivory. I have the concealer on today. It's pretty good. It's just a regular concealer that has a really cool doffle applicator and it's kind of like knifey, shaped like a knife. Knifey. Um, yeah, the concealer it's more on the liquidy side and. It's pretty it feels pretty hydrating and it's liquidy but also creamy and it's a pretty good consistency for a concealer and I'm just gonna I just have to test this out more to see how well the coverage is and how well it stays like under my eyes because that's the place that I crease the most and also my nose area crease a lot and then I have the mattifying blur primer uh blur pack it's like a blurring powder it's compacted like this I think there's only one shade because I think the powder is translucent and it's supposed to help you to um, how do you say control your oil a lot let me see yeah it's supposed to control the oil really nicely and we open it it has the powder and you flip it open it has the puff in here so it's really easy to travel around with the powder because you don't have to bring an extra brush or an extra powder uh, extra brush or extra puff with it and the worker there said that this powder is super finely milled so it works really really nicely on the skin and that is Powder. Next, let's move on to let's move on to eyes. Um, this eyeshadow quad is actually a gift if you reach more than forty eight hundred dollars. You they'll give you a forty eight hundred NT not dollars NT NT. They'll give you a eyeshadow quad. Looks like this. It's a orange base eyeshadow cloth and the name Jolly Passion Bitter Cheerful. And I really really like her cloth. I also have a uh, originally I already have her cloth in Innocent. Oh this cloth is called Hashtag Lively. This one is the Innocent palette. 
This is actually my first ever eyeshadow palette that I own and I've been using it since. So I love, love, love this palette and I'm really happy that I have the new one here. After the palette, I have some lip product. I have two lip products. One is her metallic matte lip color. Um, this is the color in hashtag possessed. This one is the color possessed. I love like it's brown. Like it's straight up brown and it's metallic liquid lipstick. Let me show how you like this. Like it's literally brown. Like metallic brown. I don't know when I'll use this color, but I'll I'll use it. I have here the second lip color is the contour lip color in Commander. This is a really more like a rosy pink um lip lipstick. It has two and two brush two handle two two heads. Yeah. Um one is a matte lip liner and the other one is a more moisturized lipstick. It's the two color lipstick and the lip liner. It's really pretty and can't wait to try this out. And I also got other than her makeup product, I also got some of her like her tools, like makeup tools. I got two brushes, which two both of them are eyeshadow brushes. I already have her um, foundation brush. I remember what's the name of that, but it's a really good foundation brush that I am using a lot. And these two are her two eyeshadow brushes. This is 202 and 204. This will be really nice for like all over your eyelid color and this will be really nice to blend in um, in your outer V of your eyes and yeah, I really like... I've been looking for this shape eye brushes for a long time so I'm really happy to get one. Last but not least, I have a... What is it called? Dual Base Brush Pro. Um, this brush is actually you kind of you kind of had to buy this brush with the butter bronzer because for the butter bron the butter highlight uh, the butter foundation the butter foundation you have to use a scoop to like scoop the thing out from inside so it comes with a brush like this this is like a artiste puffy brush and also a rubber bent rubber um spatula for you to like scrape out the product and like mix it in and i also got this brush never tried it before so i'm pretty excited to use it and yeah this is pretty much it for my pony effect haul um i kind of it's kind of everywhere but i dye my hair do you guys like it um i my hair is now it is like a dark brownie-ish green um, and I also have a little part that is highlighted into blue and I am really really happy to have this color. I was actually going for just blue but I'm like I already have blue hair before so I might as well just have a different color so I chose green for it and I also did my nails. I know that's like a lot, but it's my nails, and I also did this little like marbly mix color in. I'm really happy because I haven't treated myself for so long, and yeah, um, and that's it. I um, yeah, I'm everywhere. I'm on break right now from school, which I'm really happy because I need the break. School is just effing me over. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to me. Don't forget to press that notification button and also follow my Instagram. Yeah. So yeah, 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!